Bangalore. Bangalore is the capital of the southern Indian state of Karnataka. It is one of India's most cosmopolitan cities. Its soothing climate and vibrant local culture draw people from all over the world. Known as the Silicon Valley of India and as its garden city, the city has many fascinating things to do. Start off at the wonderfully landscaped Lal Bagh Botanical Gardens where over 1,800 species of plants are spread over 96 hectares. Don't miss the famous Lal Bagh Rock and its stunning views. Situated on nearby Bull Temple Road is the Doda Baswan Gudi, a 16th century Dravidian style temple dedicated to the Hindu deity Nandi, an attendant of the god Shiva. The temple is set inside the Bugal Rock Park. The Gavi Ganga Dhareshwara Cave Temple lies just a few roads away. It was built in the 1500s by Kempegoda, who is said to have founded the city and is dedicated to the god Shiva. Hidden in the busy KR market is the elegant Tipu Sultan's Summer Palace. It was built as a summer retreat by Mysorean ruler Tipu Sultan in 1791 and also has a museum and an art gallery dedicated to him. Close to this palace are the remains of the Bangalore Fort, which was built in the 1530s by Kempe Goda and expanded in the 1790s by Heather Ali. Unfortunately, most of it was dismantled by the British to make way for roads. In the very heart of the city is Kaban Park. Established in 1870, it has many walking paths and landscaped gardens over an area of 300 acres. Also here are the Atara Kacheri and the Bangalore Aquarium. Also around, here are the Grand Government Museum which displays carvings, archaeology and weaponry. The Vishveshwaraya Industrial and Technological Museum with its family-friendly tech and science exhibits and the Vinkat Tapa Art Gallery featuring contemporary art. Just to the north of lush Kaban Park is the colossal Vidhan Sauda, the legislative chambers of the state government. It is often called the Taj Mahal of South and is one of the city's most impressive sites. Head to the St. Mark's Cathedral located to one end of MG Road. Explore its great architecture and its peaceful grounds that are filled with trees offering a refuge from the crowd. MG Road itself is often considered the hub of the city. Here you can find everything from shops and malls to a plethora of restaurants, cafes and pubs. To the north of this road, you will see St. Mary's Basilica, one of the oldest churches in Bangalore. It is famous for its vibrant celebration of St. Mary's Feast each September. The Basilica is built in the Gothic style and also has stunning stained glass windows. You can head to the Jawaharlal Nehru Planetarium which has lots of fun experiences and exhibits about the cosmos. The Karnataka Chitrakala Parishad has a wide range of contemporary art as well as displays of Mysore style paintings and folk art from all around the world. Don't miss the Bangalore Palace which was built in 1878 for the Wodeyars, rulers of the state of Mysore. It has beautiful carvings as well as paintings by the famous Raja Ravi Verma and tons of historical artifacts. You can also visit the hilltop Iskon Temple in Rajajinagar. This lavish temple was inaugurated in 1997 by the International Society of Krishna Consciousness and holds regular concerts and lectures. Other things to do in Bangalore include visiting its many lakes such as Ulsur Lake and Hebal Lake. Finally, you can also head to the outskirts of the city to visit the Banir Gatta Biological Park which is home to tigers, lions and elephants. Or you could also check out the 400-year-old Big Banyan tree in the village of Ketohali.